real living, breathing people who need your help the most are often in poverty. But sometimes it's very difficult for lawyers who have not lived in poverty to represent clients in poverty. And that's why we welcome Dr. Donna Beagle. I am incredibly honored to be here with you today to help enhance the understanding of poverty. And as I began talking to people about poverty, I learned so quickly, even though they cared, they didn't have a clue. They could no more describe my life in generational migrant labor poverty than I could describe middle class norms. Some of the best pieces of the training were the insights into the perspectives that people who live in poverty have and the paradigm that they come from. So in pulling together this project, we really wanted to give that deeper understanding of poverty. Most of the people who study poverty in America are people who haven't lived it. A lot of what I'm going to take away from this is how I can better communicate and, and a big part of that is going to be how I can better understand my clients and what they're going through. What struck me most about today was hearing about the stories, really understanding what people are dealing with, how to best communicate with people, how to relate to clients. Could you imagine if you were representing someone in the middle of the Afghanistan war and asking them to hold on to documents and be on time? And um, So I think the war metaphor is a really helpful one for us understanding some of the behaviors. Like, well, if they really cared about this case, they would. They probably really do care, but they've got other bullets of poverty hitting them. I think it's helpful for me to think of where our, our pro bono attorneys are at, whether they've been exposed to this type of training before, and really kind of to start taking that into consideration, and then think of where the client's at, and take that to the next level of making that a good match and making sure both parties are really prepared um, for each other. Martin Luther King said if we are silent about race, we will have racism in all our systems. The same is true about poverty. I'm so excited about this training because I believe that our volunteer attorney programs play such a pivotal role not only in providing access to justice, but also in dismantling some of those policies and laws that keep people in poverty. Thank you.